Hello everyone, it's Jin Teacher coming to you from Reading Town. It's good to see you. Today's article is entitled Our Moving Planet. So planet is our home and in the solar system there are eight planets, right? There used to be nine but then they realized Pluto is a dwarf planet but our planet is Earth and it says it is moving. So let's see how and where it, it is moving to. So it says our Earth is always moving. There are two types of movement. Okay? The first one is rotation and revolution. So there's two types of movement uh, that our planet is constantly or it always moves and it moves in two ways, rotation and revolution. Rotation is the spinning of the earth. So if I take a basketball and I spin it on my finger, the ball is in rotation, it's spinning. When it spins away from the sun, night happens, right? And when it spins to the sun, this causes day. So when, let's say for example, Korea is on this side of the planet, when it's spinning towards the sun, right? That's when the daytime happens. And when it spins away from the sun, let's say Korea is over here and it's spinning away from the sun, then that's when the night happens. So as the earth spins, it causes day and night. Uh, it says it takes 24 hours or one day to complete a rotation. So one full spin around, it takes 24 hours or one day. Revolution is the earth moving around the sun. So revolution has a synonym and it's called orbit. Orbit or uh, revolution means going around something. So if this is the sun, the earth is, it's spinning, right? So the earth is in rotation, but as it's in rotation, it goes around or it revolves orbits the sun. And how long does that take? It says it takes 365 days to complete one journey around the sun. So it takes one year for the earth to spin, uh, uh, for one, one year for the earth to uh, revolve around or orbit around the sun. So every day it spins, it rotates, it takes 24 hours and as it rotates it is revolving around the sun and it takes one year to complete this revolution. Uh, this is why we have four seasons. So as you go around and around the sun, that's when we have summer, spring, fall, and winter seasons. So when the earth uh, rotates or it spins, it causes day and night. And when the earth revolves or does a revolution, it causes different seasons. So those are the two movements of our beautiful planet earth. Now let's take a look at our questions for today. Let's fill in the blank. Another picture of our planet earth. And this is as it is rotating and it is revolving. There are blank types of movements, rotation and revolution. How many is that? So rotation and revolution, how many types of movements? There are two types of movements. Rotation is the blank of the earth. So what did we say? It causes day and night and rotation is the spinning of earth. So imagine like a basketball spinning on a person's finger. That's what's happening to the earth. That's the rotation. Revolution is the earth moving around the, what is earth traveling around? And it takes 365 days for us to go around what? Uh, and it is the sun. So it takes one year or 365 days for the earth as it rotates to revolve around the sun. Okay. Uh, let's choose the correct words to complete our sentence. It says, our earth is always dancing, singing, or moving. So I don't think our planet can actually dance or sing. The people in it can, but it can't do those things, but it can move. So correct answer, our earth is always moving. So it's spinning and it's traveling around. So it takes how long? It takes 15 hours, 24 hours, or 35 hours, or one day to complete a rotation. So, uh, for Earth to spin one time, how long, how many hours are there in a day? We said 24 hours. That's one day and it causes uh, day and night. So it takes 365 weeks, months, or days to complete one journey around the sun. So how long does it take for the Earth to revolve around the sun? Does it take 365 weeks? That's a long time. 365 months, that's an even longer time or 365 days. And we know that in one year, there are 365 days. So as we learned in today's article, two movements of the earth, right? We know that the spinning is rotation 
and going around the sun is the orbit or revolution. So I hope you enjoy today's lesson and you share these two words that you learned today, rotation and revolution, to all of your friends. And I hope to see you again next time. I'll see you again. Goodbye, everyone.